previously on Detroit Become Die. Okay, let's go get breakfast. Just like snap a pigeon's neck or something. Are you done? Thank you. Thank you, Chloe, for that beautiful, beautiful song that you sing every single time that I open the main menu. Um, what did I do last time? I got car killed on the road. We need to proceed to a test of your controller. She's making my thing vibrate. The test is now complete. Thank you for your cooperation. Okay, thank you. Car and let's face Connor. Got killed on the highway, so that's cool. I think the nest is next. I just need Hank to be really mad at me. Like, super mad. And I need to get Marcus killed. Because he's annoying. He's very pretty, but he's annoying. Ooh, it's burger time. There you go. Thanks. Burger. Burger. How you doing? Uh, you know, same old shit. Usual. Yeah. Did I just show up here? Okay. Hank. Remember when I died? Fine. What the fuck? <laughs> Sorry, Lieutenant. It took me a while to find you. Are you gonna come back like this every time you get killed? Yes, absolutely. My predecessor was unfortunately destroyed. But Cyberlife transferred its memory and sent me to replace it. This incident should not affect the investigation. Not affect the investigation? I just saw you get hit by a truck! Now you come back like nothing happened? A machine was destroyed, and another machine was sent to replace it. I don't understand what's bothering me. Okay, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. Wow. He's mad. I just got a report of a suspected deviant. It's a few blocks away. We should go have a look. I'll let you finish your meal. Huh, there's I'll be no, in the car if you need me. There's no talking at all. Normally there's like, you can analyze stuff there, or have a conversation with him, but... Hey, Connor! You run out of batteries somewhere. or what? I'm sorry. I was making a report to Cyberlife. Uh. Well, do you plan on staying in the elevator? No. I'm coming. <laughs> Let's -a go. Hey, what do we know about this guy? Not Thanks. much. Just that a neighbor reported that he heard strange noises coming from this floor. Nobody's supposed to be living here, but the Can neighbor said he saw a man hiding an LED under his cap. Oh. Christ, if we have to investigate every time somebody hears a strange noise, we're gonna need more cops. Hello? Anybody home? I have cookie. Open up, Detroit police! Stay behind me. Got it. Mm, strong legs. Let's go. Well, looks like we came for nothing. Our man's gone. He's just taking care of all of his his weird cats. Can I open? Uh, he 
doesn't eat food. something weird I don't know it looks like a notebook but it's indecipherable uh, why do they have birds in his closet Driver's license is fake. Cool. At least we didn't come for nothing. Ah, Jesus, I hate these things! Mr. Krabs, you need to be more compassionate. Military jacket. RT. Probably initials. Put initials in his jacket? Any idea what it means? RA9. Written 2,471 times. Why is it obsessed with this sign? I don't know. Looks like mazes or something. I can't read. Look. Real books. I thought Let I was look. the last guy in Detroit to keep some. Let me look. Uh, electronic books. You can't smell the paper. Why See the pages paper? turning yellow. A circle. Its LED is in the sink. Not surprised it was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. A chair. Can I wood? Wooden stool recently disturbed. There. It's not obvious. He fell down. Finding him. Bird seed. Can't believe it. Find cause of loud noise. This nut job is actually feeding these fuckers. This guy. This cage is not big enough for all the birds that you have in your home. It broke. Wait, fingerprints. Wait, there's finger marks, but no fingerprints. Sliding down. I don't know. There's many points I could die. This is slow. Fast and risky.
here we go. Ah, <laughs> Jesus Christ! I died. There we go. Another Connor death for the books. I think what comes next is kind of irrelevant, so I'll try to speed run it. Every time I die and come back, I'm like, it won't happen again, sorry. Who are you? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. Uh, the trail you knew that only an android could follow the trail, didn't you? Only those who are like us can find Jericho. If you could decipher the signs, it's because one of us trusted you enough to give you the key. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho! Okay. How many are you? There are 19 of us still in working order. The rest were damaged escaping their masters. Many tried to reach Jericho. If you succeed, humans have little pity for our kind. I don't understand. I thought Jericho was a place where androids lived in freedom. We do live in freedom. It may not be what you hoped for, but here we have no master. We don't belong to anybody. We just... You're homeless and I understand dirty how boat. you feel, but we have more freedom here than you ever did. Sad. Maybe I was never really free. Maybe I was only what my master wanted me to be. And now, I need to decide who I really am. You're lost. Yeah. Just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now is deal with it. Okay. You're safe here. You can stay with us as long as you want. Thanks. Go and see Lucy. She might be able to help you. Thanks. I'm bleeding. Over here? Can you cauterize my wound, miss? Are you Lucy? Sit down. That did not answer my question. Your head's missing. I don't want to alarm you, but... Your brain is exposed. Show me. Uh, what do you want to see? Yeah. I didn't know I had an esophagus. Give me some of that drink. Go. Give me your hand. You're so demanding. Are you reading my future? You had it all, and you lost it all. You've seen hell, and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. Why me? Marcus didn't like that. Make North angry. You. What was your function before coming here? What do you care? <laughs> How long have you been here? 
Four weeks, three days, eleven hours. When I escaped, there was nowhere else to go. Jericho seemed as good a place as any. A lot of these guys are in pretty bad shape. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. They despise us. We'll never accept what we are. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. North, you're so annoying. I think I have to look at this. It lets me go. Not enough legs in this crate. Oh yeah, easy, we'll just get more. Are you the leader? Simon. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyberlife Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Yes, we can. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Oh. Maybe it's worth a try. Okay. Josh never wants to do it. We hatched an egg.